Welcome to this edition of the New Day Show. I'm Dr. Rick Kendall. This is Liz Kendall. It's oh, that yeah. time. We got the we got our, our our iPhone actually on the dashboard. I think they probably figured that out. But well, no, I'm not going to be somebody in the hood. That's true. That's true. <laughs> and we are doing what? What are we out here doing? We are going to have. Uh, we're going to do something fun. We're going to go shop Christmas shopping. Is that what you told me we were going to do? <laughs> You know, just that for it. Oh, no. <laughs> no, we're glad you're with us, and we hope to give you some fun messages today. Yes. Important messages. Yes. And have some fun as well. Right. Yeah. Right. We so. Will. Well, actually, we're just looking right now. Thank we goodness. Got, yes. We're just looking. <laughs> yeah, we got a budget, and we're just going to look to see where that budget fits. So we're going to take you shopping with us this morning. Hope you enjoy it. And for a really good gift giving idea, check this out. <laughs> Can't, can't drive and chew gum at the same time. I know. <laughs> Oh, this is your aisle, honey. Isn't it wonderful? <laughs> well, you know, if you buy the, the brand, what do you call it? The uh, name brand, it's going to be a lot more expensive than you buy the genetic brand. Did you know that? Genetics are over there. <laughs> <laughs> We're thinking of something for our grandbaby, Richard. And we're either going to get a bunch of little things that are fun or something more substantial that is within our budget because we have a certain uh, amount of money allotted to it. So, so, how much is that? This one is $49.96. I think maybe we'll oh, no, think no. about something else. No, that one is uh, $129. Oh, let's move on. <laughs> the grandbabies. <laughs> of course. <laughs> All this Christmas stuff and can I find the Christ child? Wait, 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 wait. I think well, I thought I found Jesus in this Christmas stuff, but I don't think he's even here in this. What's going on? Yep. Yeah, that line right there is his <laughs> face expresses exactly how I feel about shopping at Christmas. How about this one? <laughs> uh, that would be you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> share a little bit of a health tip even though we're shopping right now but that's important. Um, here we have the regular microwave. This is a pretty sophisticated one. Very nice. And it could be, we all know what it does. It, it cooks things in a hurry and it warms them up in a hurry. The problem is that it uh, emanates uh, radiation and that's not really good for your food because when you eat it in a very microscopic way you're getting some radiation in your body. So it's better to cook in an oven like this. You know, it's little, but it does take more time. I do recommend another oven that's in the market that you can see here. I haven't seen it here, but it's called New Wave Oven. And it cooks faster than this kind of oven. And it's very healthy for you because the fat falls to the bottom. Any fat, like fat from steak or something like that. 
So, but it's a lot more healthy to cook that way and it's faster also. Ah, the old standard toaster <laughs> works every time. I wonder how many people have like five toasters. Maybe better not. Hey, listen, you know, I know it's shopping season. We're out doing it. We're having some fun. I hope nobody's getting upset at our fun. But the truth of the matter is, we know that this is about the greatest gift in the world, to the world, and that is redemption. You know, we're not supposed to get in debt over being redeemed. This gift that God gave was to free us, not to cause us to continue to feel in bondage, to give things out of a necessity. So think twice this season about maybe the motivation of what you're doing just say, you know what, maybe it's time for me to introduce to my family what a gift is truly all about. A gift? Is it a gift if it's owed? If somebody owes you a gift, is it truly a gift? It's a gift when it's freely given. And so, you know, this is not meant to bring condemnation. But in your shopping, ask yourself, am I giving a gift simply because it truly does represent the free gift? of the Son of God who was born? Or am I given this gift because I owe it? Maybe time for a change of mind so that when you go into 2012, you don't have to be wore out. Just a thought. In the meantime, I wonder who needs a waffle maker. Through the world Sometimes I feel the world is drifting further from the sun As everybody's shoulders are getting colder one by one I heard a rumor yesterday The war was gonna come my way I heard it from a longtime friend of mine So I look at the state of the world, take a look at the sorrow Turn my face to a place where I won't be afraid of tomorrow And even though I know I can't escape it By the grace of God I'm gonna make it Through the world Well, there you have it. We bought exactly how much? Zero. Zero. But uh, we're going to look and make sure we're, we're giving because we know it's what somebody really needs. Uh -huh. Oh, listen to that holiday honking, huh? <laughs> wow. Yeah, it's great. But we want to encourage you not to feel condemned if you've charged your cards, but at the same time, do everything you can to stay free of the credit cards. It's hard nowadays to I know. Do that. It is. But it can we happen. Get a whole lot of stuff right then. Yeah, we were tempted, but we're going to stay debt free. So we'll be talking more about this in programs to come. But until next week, this is Rick and Liz saying we love you and and see you next week. And way back you promised me. Way back you promised me. Yeah, back in the day you promised me that.